Sarah Ferguson won't remarry Prince Andrew for one key reason. Sarah Ferguson and Prince Andrew won't remarry because it would risk complicating their relationship, a royal expert has said. Royal author Victoria Arbiter refuted long-standing claims that the Duke and Duchess of York could one day retie the knot. Prince Andrew proposed to Sarah Ferguson at Flores Castle in the Scottish Borders on February 19, 1986, his 26th birthday. The couple went on to marry in a lavish Westminster Abbey ceremony just weeks later on July 23rd that year. It was then that the late Queen Elizabeth II conferred the titles of Duke and Duchess of York upon the newlyweds. But their relationship started to unravel relatively early on as the prince pursued his naval career while Fergie was at home, raising their young children, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie. And the pair legally separated in 1992 with the infamous toe-sucking scandal breaking in office that year as intimate photos of the Duchess of York appeared with US businessman John Bryan. After that, Fergie became estranged from the royal family, with the York's divorce finally becoming official in 1996. Since then, relations between the Duchess of York and the Windsors have thawed. She recently appeared alongside the royals during their annual Christmas Day walkabout at Sandringham, with Queen Camilla set to play a part in her return. While the Duke and Duchess of York share a home, Royal Lodge in Windsor Great Park, Ferguson maintains that they are the most contented divorced couple. Miss Arbiter pointed out to the comment that she argued the Yorks are unlikely to marry. She said, Fergie's previously said they're the happiest divorced couple she knows, so there's little to be gained by remarrying. They've always shown immense loyalty towards each other, and clearly their relationship works exactly as it is.